hello everyone welcome back to another class so this is a continuation of NPAC mains series where my essay topic discuss grow and this is the lesson number three of essay writing so the today's topic is free movement regime so it will Actually, charge that is a free movement regime, though, and we will be discussing actually it is and from men's perspective, kina question now. So, it do we can expect 20 marks question in Nagaland? Essay Nishna be over regarding India's relation with Myanmar, but uh, most probably 20 or 10 marks Nagaland. Or paper one, or may, maybe essay in Ishnavi. So, discuss the free movement regime and how it, it will impact on northeastern region. In Gabi, over particularly Nagal and Eklavine. So, we'll be discussing this. So, let us start. The first two cases will do introduction. So, uh, recently India has reviewed the plan to, as re, uh, to review the free movement regime. So, it is Ajila newspaper that is on October, uh, on February 10. It has been said that India suspends free movement regime with Myanmar. So, February 10, Ajila newspaper, the Dinazi gave India has suspended. India has suspended the free movement regime with Myanmar. So, the review is the free movement regime. The so free movement regime though, it is an agreement with Myanmar and introduction again the recent plans to review Nina India's India has recently suspended the free movement regime with the Myanmar government and the fence the India Myanmar border have initiated discussion, especially in the northeastern region states. The decisions aim to address a complex intersection of historical, cultural, and security consideration. So, um, with the ramification, kike is the historical, as a cultural, as a security consideration. It would in the angle, ba I hope. So, is an essay the historical impact or security reason or cultural aspect? Pavi, I will break question though. We never know from what angle they will ask, but let us look at the general overview of the free movement regime. So, free movement regime na historical context chau them. That is, we do kita shuru kuchh lo do 1826 pa shuru Treaty of Yandabo. We know that Mona Nagaland government, uh, Mona Nagaland or nor most of the northeastern states do under uh, it was equal boundary thakar na India or Myanmar nation. Inka. So. 1826 the Treaty of Yandabo signed Treaty of Yandabo the first Burmese war India ro, British India ro, do Burma do, Jagar Kilija and British Manama Do 1826 the uh, it was this Treaty of Yandabo was signed and it was it established the current Indo Myanmar boundary the Treaty of Yandabo was signed by General Archibald Campbell. So, uh, with on behalf of the British and General of uh, Burma, that is Liang Ang Maha Min La Gua, Ka, Gua Tin, on behalf of the Burmese. So, one important question is that it do Treaty of Yandabo sign Gorum the Kundeshit, the Governor General. So, the General. Governor General was Lord Amherst. A M H E R S T. Lord Amherst Station. Thai 1823 Balina. 1823 Balina. 1828 Kashi. So, it was 1828 Lord William Bendy Kashi. So, many of you may be confused that. It is not Lord William Bendick, it is Lord Amherst. That's why the Treaty of Yandabo is signed. 
the time the first Anglo Burmese war be killed and the British won. So after you do Treaty of Yanobo Vijaya, you do boundary do tan democratic British India or Myanmar means it is kiman da khole is British monarch kiman claim kro or Burmese monarch kiman thakko do sab thakan claim kro is democratic kro is. However, the border separated communities which shared ethnicity and culture, including the Nagas of Nagaland, Manipur, as well as the Jin, Kuki, Mizo communities in Myanmar and Mizoram without their without their agreement. Currently, India and Myanmar the border to 1643 kilometers along the Indus Myanmar, uh, Chada, Mizoram, Nagaland and Arunachal Pradesh, of which Manaze only ten kilometers of fence corners to be money borders. So it basically case of little it is no distance status. This is Arido Myanmar. So pull out the case of little it boundary to the This boundary was not there, it was like that before 1826. 1826 then, Treaty of Yandaboba, it was democratic condition means Myanmar, it or British India. So because of this, it was. It is border there, mano thakado means kumba do yeri be thakisho border there. So it do ando displace means ta ando kuti jawo na chana It created uh, com, uh, separation between the communities, especially Jharkhand state pa. That is namely ki kaise? That is Manipur se, Mizoram se, Nagaland se, and Arunachal Pradesh. So let us study the basic. Uh, definition of free movement regime free movement regime the 2018 the established question as a part of india's act is policy so 1992 uh, 1992 for uh, india look is policy look is policy under pv narishma rao he do currently the bharat ratna policy also current affairs so that the time the look is policy though implement question so 2000 and uh, Modi government abis de 2014 de act is policy sure guja means instead of looking it the acro policy to maintain good relations with the Southeast Asian nations. So as a part of the act is policy, uh, the free movement regime do takan sh uh, sure and it promotes cross border movement up to 16 kilometer without a visa. Individual residing in the border need one year border pass for staying lasting up to two weeks in the neighboring country. It aims to facilitate border trade, improve access to education and healthcare, and strengthen diplomatic ties. So, free movement regime the case of little suppose it was a so uh, this is the northeastern region or the Myanmar. So, Ito or Myanmar la moje de ito boundary ta tako. That is 15 kilometer, 16 kilometer. So ito 16 kilometer la, ito 16 kilometer la border de without visa. So takan free movement group. That is Myanmar manon ayoboro India manon be inga trade korbo. Especially the eastern mon nagle ni shikli do. Especially in the eastern nagas like ito. Kemion and the Konyaks, the Burmese Konyaks come here. So, it within 16 kilometer do, takan aja kuro So this is the free movement regime. So free movement regime the definition ni kaise gulo do? It was started in 2018 as a part of the act is policy in, uh, that promotes cross border movement up to 16 kilometer without a visa all right individuals residing at the border at the border reset kormonodo need a one year border pass for lasting up to two weeks for days lasting up to two weeks in the neighboring country so if the border that are one year border pass lule for more than two for up to two weeks it was supposed to go little arrow it will main empty case of little trade especially trade arrow means local samangan or improve access to education uh, we might not realize but in the further in the eastern parts of Nag in Nagaland there are many children who are 
uh, who wants to study they want to pursue education will be because of infrastructure problem because of uh, connectivity problem they are not able to come so we do arrow because of visa issues you do than education all over so the main one of the main aim to education visa or healthcare means uh, for uh, accessing the medical facilities arrow diplomatic ties between Myanmar and India so it is free movement regime to key karne one in the uh, Indian government bar suspend good issue with Myanmar government first is the security concerns security case of increased infiltration because there are many underground uh, underground insurgents like the Ulfa Pekdaze the cookie revolutionary army base we know in August the NSCN base row uh, NSN IM K like that so there are many insurgent groups that are operating here and because of this it will free movement region like suppose India man on operation question India there so they can they can escape to Myanmar because free visas are that they can move anywhere so because of this it do infiltration area and also uh, in 2020 21 day cool day she Myanmar government ke hatai di na ito military rule ashe ito aun saan yuki ke imprison condition because of this there are many displacement in Myanmar especially the in Manipur the Zomi cookie gun Zomi cookie gun especially the bishi displacement because of this and also one of the main issue is the Rohingyas Muslim Rohingya Rohingya kan do ek da minority muslim minorities is in money in myanmar so it one polina aina india they settle kore so because of this security infiltration hoy je are do ido ba ki kiwe straining resources means khalo ta ando because ke jukle do tan aina tan establish kor villages kan so ido dhan jan jan so khatam kor do and impacting local demographics means demographics means manula demography do bia kor do means tan aina maiki an rishigli to they will neither be indian citizen nor myanmar citizen in between the two so it will impact local demographics next the case of the drug trafficking we know that uh it will not extend region rishigli to myanmar myanmar thailand aro laos thailand or laos it will tinda do they share a common border known as the that they share a triangle known as the golden triangle where you know drugs drugs can uh, supply good means what are they poppy field can ganja can panay grow good arrow down with the heroin gun so we're not on grow good so golden triangle you do Myanmar Laos arrow Thailand it would in the so because of this you do drugs can do not is in region and in a it do demo borba or alak railway station ba other parts of the country there to come uh kick away good uh small go smuggle gray so if you look at there it do myanmar is a arado laos is a arado niche the thailand is a so it do tindala juncture there ekta as a key it do get golden triangle way so it do golden triangle there drugs can especially the uh heroin arrow cocaine etc the soap to it a manufacturer so it a manufacturer and i then not eastern region especially in uh manipur mizoram nagaland and arnacha british dg adena to the rest of the country to supply it so because of this drug problem it do free movement regime back the reason as it do suspend and one this this can be explained by the data that manipur day 2022 the session lay 500 cases filed and 625 individuals were arrested under the nation narcotic drugs and psychotropic substances act from the chief minister's office it was a, a third to insurgency activities so this i i've explained earlier that free movement regime to insurgent gamba cholai in northeastern region there takan aina 
Lokoina, Tangana illegal operation do Tangan Chalogore. So for example, the Kuki National Organization, the Kang Kanglebak Communist Party Lampel in Manipur. So these are some of the reasons because of which in the free movement regime do uh, remove Kodija. So they are basically thin the reason. The first thing is the illegal immigration as a immigration problem as a illegal immigration as a or second the drugs as a Aro security concerns the aro ekta do um, insurgency activities aro ito sa aro next do socio economic aro regional issues aro alak problems tiki ay zuglito cultural identity mo kones na ito sa for example um, Myanmar Myanmar nagas kan ay na tagan sa talguna if they have children then they will never be Indian because Indian manon accept no kordon because his father is from Myanmar and his wife is from Nagal uh, from India so he cannot claim the Indian citizen it, he will neither be Indian nor the Myanmar citizen so it will impact the cultural identity concerns existing about the preservation of indigenous culture and traditions in border areas potentially threatened by increased migration Next, the environmental degradation. Tan aina pet khali do bune. They will do some farming work. So farming work them de. Mostly they will practice jum cultivation. So jum cultivation them de. Takan ido forest concept do July do or they will grow crops because of this soil degradation or increase in acidity salinity of the soil or uh, subsidence farming grows or it was soil erosion kami hoy. So it will lead to environmental degradation. Next to regional dynamics. Because China though already busy influential as a among the in uh, especially in the northeastern region because because of the cultural affinity means one culture because of this because of this they give arms training to arms and ammunition with the to the arms and ammunition military training with the to overthrow the Indian government so they are providing various training to the underground Nagas so Takan secessionist it do it do then this is to Takan China Gamba Janet Gray so because of this Takan because of China's influence in Myanmar and potential impact on water security it's another layer of complexity because China claims that even Arunachal Pradesh though it comes under the Arunachal Pradesh it comes under the Chinese government like the Tibet and this uh, Taiwan it goes up to expansionist policy Myanmar to be growing influences so these are some of the reasons it will national it will security issues on the Chinese but cultural identity or environmental the degradation or China's influence back the reason as well let us look at the India Myanmar relation so as I've already told you, India and Myanmar are a bad relation share Not only with Myanmar but also with other the Southeast Asian nations like Thailand, Laos, Vietnam, like that. Uh, especially the act is policy as a act is policy. Act is policy though 2014 the by the Modi government. Act is policy by the Southeastern Asian nations look at the relation bond below uh, in connectivity cultural connectivity means uh, road can waterways can yet yeah, way water uh, means waterways or road connected to especially in Nagaland if you see more or in uh, Nagaland la mojo de rasta ball banana connectivity in cultural appropriation uh, cultural connectivity or trade etc so and security reason be there so these are some of the reasons why india maintains good relation with the southeastern nations so myanmar loti ek is policy as a ara kaladan project be there kaladan kaladan project be there um to ki koi uh ito inland waterways project be shuru karna with myanmar so let us look at some of the reasons. 
historical and cultural ties to India or Myanmar to Tan Myanmar to Buddhism as a so they share cultural ties or Treaty of Friendship signed in 1951 that laid the foundation of the diplomatic relation or economic cooperation there India to Myanmar Myanmar the fourth largest trading partners and major source of investment for example Kaldatan multimodal transit project as a Trilateral Highway Project as a, and Restoration and Conservation of the Ananda Temple at Bakan uh, at Bakan completed in 2018 to call, call the Multimodal Transit Project act as a, and Trilateral Highway Project as a. recently though Cyclone Mora uh, means 2017 the Cyclone Mora uh, uh, helped Korea in Myanmar and outbreak of influenza virus in Yangon around 2020 COVID time to be vaccine gun so India was supply Russia to maintain the vaccine diplomacy so what are the waves forward for this so since India already uh, suspend Russia free movement regime so what are the conclusion focus on shared interest we know that one India manon is now Myanmar can be taken into immigration issue to face crazy like Myanmar Manan, India the Anishna, Inaga Manambe, or the North Eastern uh, people are also going to Myanmar, so it will create the border issues. So it will focus on continuing and expanding Aro comprehensive border management, Aro economic cooperation, be continuing and expanding economic cooperation in infrastructure, energy, trade could benefit both nations, fostering deeper ties beyond political differences, also encouraging cultural exchanges. Religious tourism can help build trust and understanding. Okay. Next to comprehensive border management. In India, Myanmar, 1,463 km borders. Out of which only uh, 40 km is uh, 10 km is not. Fencing in the Recently, the Indian government has fencing in the So, this will be a step in in achieving border management between Myanmar and India. Are the security reasons can be drug problem be it is up to soft global supporting a democratic transition. So in that democracy is will be Myanmar to the military rulers. So assess the uh, democratic transition group India's engagement with Myanmar should be ultimately aim to support a peaceful transition to democracy in Myanmar so with this the video on free movement regime has been completed it was 5 marks 10 marks 20 marks of coverage over and with this the video will be concluded I hope you all understood something and if you like this content you can like and subscribe and you can also share to the other people who are preparing for mains and also who are thinking of preparing for the exam and with this i'll conclude my video and if you have, if you have any problem to, you can contact me in the social media i'll be happy to respond there are many students who are, who are giving me who are asking me questions and i'm repeatedly uh, helping them so let us conclude this video thank you guys for watching and all the best for your exam thank you